Hey, what's going on, guys? It's Alex going crazy, and today I'm going to be teaching you guys how to make your 808s hit harder, and then I'm going to be making a little, I don't know, not a Pyrex type beat, but just like, I don't know, a hard beat, something like that. And yeah, so first thing you want to do, j this is this is just going to be the part for the 808, how to make it hit harder, which should be pretty obvious, but you just turn the volume knob all the way up, and then go over and cut, it, uh, cut the 808, or you can do it like this, just right click and cut itself. And then this is only available on FL11 and FL20, but it's pre-computed effects or legacy effects. With legacy effects in 11, you have to turn them on yourself. They can't just be automatically on. And so now you just click this on 20 and turn the boost knob up on your 808. So I'm just going to my stash and then I'm going to put this 808 in. And then it makes it hit harder. And you, if you want to go, Bruh. I mean, if that's what you want, you can do that, but that's that's usually how I like it. And uh, I guess I'll do some 808 rolls because people from my Pyrex video wanted to know how the 808 rolls were done. So I just, I'll do some of those, but I guess I'll make like a got it type beat. We're going for something like that. And I think today I'm going to be using uh, Susio's loops. So shout out to him. And yeah, let's get into it.
Okay, now that I have all my drums done, I'm going to go in and I'm going to place everything how I want it to be. And I'm going to structure the beat. And then I'll come back when that's done. One thing I want to remind you, I think it's done now, I'm just going to take this and cut it out and then paste this over, add another two right here, maybe a little breakdown, cut that out. But yeah, uh, that's pretty much the end of the beat and I just want to remind you guys, I never listened to the sample once and uh, I made that. Personally, I'm astounded how I did that, but 